Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome back to Arya's story. Previously, we entered Horror World, which is a place we quickly learned the point of. So I'm not really sure what they're gonna throw at me next. Two cat? Two cat? Inside joke. It's not only like inside, but it's a meme. Don't touch that! It's just a spooky, scary skeleton. What's it gonna do to me? An armoire decorated with a picture of a butterfly. Hmm? There's a math book here. It must be a mistake. It's not a mistake. These are the scariest books that have ever existed! <laughs> I guess that means you're not very good at math. There's a bunch of potions on the table. Potions. There's a bunch of potions on the table. Potions. There's a bunch of potions on the table. Potions. There's a bunch of potions on the table. Potions. Hmm. There's a lot of potions in here. There's a weird liquid in the cauldron. I'm preparing this new potion. Potion. I just need to find some butterfly wings to complete it. Hmm, but where could I find some? Where that one big butterfly was? Then I need a number to, like, solve it. Could take a shot in the dark. Alright. We'll give it a shot in the dark. If you know what number. Damn. The cat's looking at me. Are you the spirit of a book? Don't worry about me. Being a spirit has some advantages. For example, I can pass through walls. And annoying kids won't scribble on me anymore. They return me to the library and ask like they didn't do it. Annoying kids. Really? Sure, I want to see how you do it. Are you going to murder me? Wait, what? Ooh. Secret. This is kind of weird. Alright, so we gotta count the butterflies. Well, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12? Let me double check. Or was that? No, it might be 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 11. 11 butterflies. Ah, ah, ah. So then would the answer be 11? But there's three slots there for numbers. That could just be a throw me off. Have you finished? This is the weirdest way to solve a puzzle I've ever seen. Okay, it was just 11. I guess the one slot's just to throw you off. You've attained the butterfly wings. Manly didn't go back and save, if you noticed. Manly's taming his habits. He's turning over a new leaf. Lack of save, Manly. That's right, we'll be conservative with saves. Give the butterfly wings. This is just what I need. Wait, I'm going to finish the potion. Thank you for helping me. This is for you. Invisibility potion, sweet. There's a bunch of potions on the table. Potions. So what would I do with the invisibility potion? Go up there. Uh, hey. Oh. You 
You can't do anything if you can't see me. What you gonna do? The damn ghosts. Look at me, I'm invisible, just like a ghost. And I'm corporal if I want to be. I have the best of both worlds. I can go shopping, you can't. Sucks for you. We're back to normal. It seems like the potion lost its effectiveness. The lost skulls. That's a lot of books. Surrounded by darkness, she advanced bravely with her companion. Narrator. Wait! Don't! Go! Uh, my head. Are you okay? Do you need help? I do not understand what is happening to me. I have been feeling strange for a while. I feel like I'm forgetting something very important. But when I try to remember it, my head hurts. Huh? Something important. Yes. And the pain is more intense when look at Arya. Ah, uh, what am I doing? I am a narrator. I should not tell you about my problems. Are you her mom? So you like, used to read books to her or something? You don't look anything alike. Well, there's the same face syndrome, but you know, aside from other features. Why not? I'd like to know more about you. <gasps> about me. Why? <laughs> because I think you're very interesting. Shut up. You do not know anything about me. That's why I want to know you better. Uh? What? Uh, I am a narrator, and my duty is to narrate what happens to you. That is all. If you have any problems, I'd like to help you. If you knew how I really am, you would not say the same. <laughs> it doesn't matter to me. Friends are there to help each other. Uh? Friends. Do you consider me your friend? I do not understand it. The wind doesn't talk much, but I'm sure he has the same idea. No. See, he hides a knife behind his back. Yes, that's true. As I hide a knife behind my back. Ugh. Ah. Does it still hurt? No. I'm fine. Narrator. Arya. I do not understand. What's happening? Are you okay? Uh, yes. Arya, there will be someone waiting for you at the end of this area. Hurry up. <gasps> Who? My true self. Now I must leave. I feel confused and I'd like to be alone for a while. Don't we all? Thank you for keeping my secret all this time. For being a horror area, this place has been pretty tame. I mean, so far. So what we got? We got books? Have you ever tried writing a horror book? I tried, but it's hard to write one. I'll like to try again when I have more experience. Door over here. Path down. Spooky doll over here, we don't care about you. Locked. Also equally locked. Huh? What's wrong? My head hurts. I think this is what happened to the narrator. Maybe it's just exhaustion. Don't worry, I'm fine. Why don't you rest a bit? I'll find the key to this door. <laughs> I don't want to stay here doing nothing. That's not fair. Take this. You obtain Lowen's knife. A knife? You'll be able to protect yourself if something happens. I'll murder you the old-fashioned way later. I'm gonna look for the key. I'll be back soon. Don't ignore me. Oh, I need to let you know about something. If you see a pink door, don't open it. If you open it, I'll be very angry with you. Why? Don't open it. That's all. Now that you mentioned it, you have to tell me about it. <sighs> I told you the rest. I'll be right back.
Ooh. Playing this one new. There's mystery books in this bookshelf. This author's books are always very good. I should recommend the one to Arya. Such a change of pace. You were about to stab her in the back earlier. Now you can recommend- Oh, there's a statue. Yeah, no. Death spikes. I can't go through here. I tried it. Can't say I wasn't brave. It looks like wine, but it's actually blood. Castlevania? I need your help. Could you help me? I'm busy. I don't have time to help you. Wait. You're the only one who can help me. <sighs> Fine. I'm an old book. My pages are worn and the title of my cover has been erased. Could you write it again? My title is very important to me. Please help me. <sighs> I'll try. But I can't promise you anything. So how am I helping you? Do I just guess... ...which book you are? I mean, I already have a inkling considering there's a... ...that statue wasn't here before. You know... ...coffin... ...drinks of blood... I mean, from all that, we can obviously deduce which book it is. YouTubers 101. So what was this book for? Ah, I need to hit the gap. To get the scissors to, uh... Do something. But to do that... I've got to push the book the right way. There's only one place we can push you, which is over here. Then we gotta push you down. Then we gotta be very careful about what we do over our next move. Because we push you straight down, you're actually locked in. So we have to get you out of there. To right there. And then we send the book to the abyss. Take it or leave it. So now we have scissors. That is going to be used for something. We didn't see that. What was in here? Have I been in here before? I don't think so. Was this blocked off? Or did I just not notice it? Hmm. I really like these books. They were a big inspiration to me. Meow. Meow. Oh, a cat. I think they're fascinating creatures. You can see a beautiful moon through the window. The thorns of these roads are very sharp. I can't go through. Cut these. Ink pot. So now we got quill and ink, we can write in the book. Do what it wants. That's right. Manly conservative saves. Living it up. Write the title of the book. Are you going to help me? Thank you. The title of my cover is Dracula. Don't move. I'm going to write it. Please don't come out of the thing and attack me afterwards. I'm not a Belmont here. Oh, <laughs> that tickles. I can't write if you don't stop moving. I'm finished. Sorry my hand is injured. I, and I can't write well. Don't apologize. This is perfect. Thank you, I feel young again. So what do we gain from doing that? The spikes gone? Oh. What? Huh. Attempted this. 
save. But won't. Conservative of saves now. Take the key. I got the key. Now I gotta get back to Arya. Hey, what's up? It's the passing by book. See you later. Who is that book? The book went through the store. Hmm. Horror. What's this place? This place feels very different. This place connects all the other areas of the library to each other. You can go to any area from here. Is that a pink door? However, only the door of the horror area is open. I see. Do you see that pink door? That's the center of the library. It's a very special place. I wanted to visit a friend who lives in the romance area, but the door is closed. Just like my heart. Question mark? Is there even a point? Need to find a save point! No! The one time I should have saved, I didn't! Curse you, conservative save manly! A pink door. The wind told me I shouldn't go into it. But, I think I should explore every nook and cranny of this place. What should I do? I should think before making a final decision. Wait. We'll, we'll do both, I mean, obviously. I'll just load back to the save. That's a little too far back. What are you doing here? The win. Did you open this door? I told you not to open it. I didn't open it. You didn't open it. Mm. Alright. Take this. I found the key to that door. I want to give you back the knife. What was the point of that? By the way, are you feeling better? I'm fine. I'm glad to hear that. Stop. Don't open that door. Okay, so we gotta make a save here, and then we gotta load the other one. Eh? This is... My room. It all makes sense. Why is my room in this place? Look, there's another chest set. This is the center of the library. It's very practical. You can access any area from your room. But this is only a copy. Your real room is in your world. Chess, my favorite game. My book collection. These don't fit on my bookshelf, so I have to put them on the floor. Ooh, easy access for bugs. What's this? A photo? Eh? No, I don't understand. That's impossible. I don't remember this. My head. Uh, it hurts so much. Are you okay? Well, the bug is actually concerned about me. Wait, I'm gonna look for help. You don't need to do that. I I'm fine. Contain a photo. Let me take you to the exit. I hope you feel better soon. Hmm. What are you doing here? The wind. Did you open this door? I told you not to open it. Answer me. Did you open the door? Oh no. Wow. 
What did you say? I was surprised to see my room, but I didn't see anything strange. Did you see anything that caught your attention? No, I didn't see anything. Hmm. All right. Take this. I found the key to that door. I want to give you back the knife. By the way, are you feeling better? I'm fine. I'm glad to hear that. Hmm. So is this the end of... Horror Realm? No, there's a little bit more left, I think. What are you looking at? I think I saw a rat behind this book. A rat? Ugh. You can't live here. A bookshelf is a place where books live, not rats. Hey, hey out of the way, it might bite. You say this concerning the one li- Whoa! One library is full of, you know... Ivy, and mold, and moss. You know, it will of it being built in a forest. Random rabbits set loot. Why did you appear when I said rabbits? Is that how you want to be? Is that how it goes? At least I think this thing is over with. Finally, they reached the end of the horror area. As she had promised, she showed them. Her true appearance. I wear glasses. Are you surprised? A narrator. I am not a narrator. I am only human. A boring human. In fact, I was so boring that nobody wanted to be my friend when I was little. Everyone ignored me. That is the reason I said to copy the personalities of the characters and books I liked. I thought I would become an interesting person and I could have friends. Well, you really are a chuny. But... Now. I am not sure which parts of myself are real and which parts are things I copied from the books. Narrator does not exist. She is only one of the personalities I copied. I am sure you do not comprehend anything I'm saying. I'm sorry for saying such strange things. Arya, you are a girl that loves books and spends a lot of time reading them. A bookworm. Lewin also adores books, but he enjoys writing them. He is a very talented writer. My real talent is not being narrator, even though it is something similar. I am a storyteller. My duty is to tell tales that are for people, especially children and old people. A storyteller. Then why did you narrate what I was doing? Mm. I do not know the answer. I am just doing a favor to someone. A person asked me to narrate everything you did, but I do not know the true purpose. There's someone else in this library, right? Yes, that is correct. There is someone else. There's someone else trapped in this place? Who? Someone you both know very well. Do you mean... It can't be. Yes. I must apologize. Well, I was acting as narrator. I said cruel things, especially to Arya. I don't really remember anything cruel, particularly. I'm duly sorry for that. It doesn't matter. I'm sure you had a reasons for doing it. Not at all. But I don't want you to say you're just a boring human. You're really a very interesting person. It's not your fault Everest couldn't appreciate how marvelous you are. Thank you. These words are very nostalgic. Arya, huh? your head keeps hurting. This is the same that happened to me before. Maybe I'm also trying to remember something. Mm. I see. Arya, there's something very important you must know. Uh. Wait. Arya, the truth is... Goodbye. Huh? What's happening? <gasps> I'm disappearing. No, it can't be. I understand. I'm not necessary in this story anymore because I decided to stop acting as a narrator. Or maybe I'm disappearing because I should not tell her the truth. 
Do not worry, I won't be fine. Keep advancing until the end. I am sure we will meet again. Dahlia. That is my true name. No! Why? This should have never have happened. Actually, we don't know the rules of this place. Maybe it should have happened. Unless you do know the rules. Arya, we've got to hurry. We need to find the other person that's inside the library. Lewin. Eh? Dahlia. Library. Huh? What are you saying? Books. <gasps> Arya! I finished reading the book. What do you think about it? I loved it. Your books are always my favorites. It's that so. I'm glad to hear that. But one day you should write a happy ending. Happy endings aren't my specialty. How do you know? You've never tried to write one. Hmm. Oh! Hmm. I'll help you write a happy ending. Uh, Arya, thank you, but you suck at writing stories. Uh, that was very rude. Oh, it's getting late. I should get going. It's true. You should go back home before it gets dark. See you tomorrow. See you. <laughs> Sorry, Lewin. I think I fainted. But I need to tell you something important. <gasps> Lewin. Lewin, where are you? Maybe he disappeared too. Is this all my fault? Dahlia. Lewin. <laughs> now, now. No need to cry. As far as we know, no one exists anyway. No, I don't want to cry. I must be strong. I must be brave. The story isn't over yet. <gasps> What's this? A letter. The wind's letter, read it. Don't worry about me, I'm fine. I suddenly get to the next area while you were sleeping. There's something I want to see with my own eyes. You're smart and strong, so I have no doubt that you'll be able to get to the end without my help. It's been fun being by your side. I'm so glad I got to know you. The final chapter. Oh no! Trees! And moss! On the books! How awful.